Hi, this will be a very short video. I just don't want to call this tutorial because I'm not a specialist about replacing the hairspring in this balance wheel. Okay, so as you see here, the hairspring is bent. Here is the roller jewel and here is the stud, so the end of the hairspring and I know that from a working movement. Let's start this delicate operation. I'm using here a sharp screwdriver. There is a special tool for that, which I unfortunately don't have, but I should be also successful with this screwdriver. I need to be only very, very delicate. So take time, this video is quite short, but anyway, do not rush here. Okay, here we have it. Okay, I see the screwdriver is magnetized as well as the handspring. I hope the new one won't be. Let's remove this wheel and from this balance wheel, which has a broken balance staff, I will reuse this handspring in my old balance wheel. So what I have done literally was exactly the same like you saw before. So that's my old balance wheel. And here is the roller jewel and I need to install correctly the handspring. That's the main ties. Oops. And the end of the handspring should be somewhere here. should be like that okay maybe like that now only a little bit pressing and tighten it in the balance stuff okay I think it's already there let's check it okay it's holding Okay, it wasn't very, very difficult. Anyway, you have to be very, very careful. And now I have to install the balance wheel on this main plate and the roller jewel should be exactly between these two pins. Let's start the installation. So first the balance wheel. And now the balance bridge called also balance cock here also you have to be careful here not to break or damage the balance stuff okay maybe now it's not okay let's fix this okay now it sits and now the end of the handspring, so the stud, I need to push in this hole of this balance bridge. I'm doing this in this way. Okay, not very efficient way. And the handspring here is not sitting between these two posts. So in this lock, I will also have to take care about that. But first let's tighten the balance bridge. Now I will just push the start, tighten this screw that is holding this hairspring on place and having the top jewel, well, it's swinging, looks okay. Of course we cannot predict now anything, the hairspring is between these two pins, so in the lock it's just jump on by itself. There is the roller jewel, we cannot see here, so I can see, but you note know that it is between these two pins, so it should be okay. I also quickly install all the wheels, just checking because I wasn't able to do this in my last video. The pellet fork here is engaging correctly with the escape wheel. I'm using here also a different barrel with a different main spring 
which has a different pearl arbor i will also have to replace it and the mainspring is from this kind of movement so it is a newer version i also found a replacement for the fourth wheel with the second pin that's the comparison so i hope you will be present when i will be launching my next video so be sure that you subscribe ticking watch if you are still watching this video you really should smash the like button and in the meanwhile see my other videos okay that's it bye bye and i will catch you in the next one